Good evening, Cavaliers, and welcome to our Cuthbertson High School Senior Awards Program. My name is Jeff Stout, and I have had the honor and privilege of serving as principal for our 450 wonderful graduates. While we'll only be able to recognize a few tonight, please know that I am extremely proud of each and every one of you. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get this program started. This year, the Chorus Award is going to a young man who most people would tell you is the nicest guy at Cuthbertson. He embodies all that a chorus member should be. He is kind, always encouraging, my biggest cheerleader, a very talented singer musician, and he has been a staple of the chorus program for the last four years. His graduating will leave a huge hole in the tenor section, and it will also leave a huge hole in my heart. It is with great fondness and pride that the senior receiving the Chorus Award this year is none other than Dominic Patali. Congratulations, Dominic. Hello. The top academic award for instrumental music goes to Jacqueline Gardner. Jacqueline has gone above and beyond the curriculum for band in the state of North Carolina and has achieved not only first chair seat in her ensemble at the advanced level, but also held the position of concert master in the Blue Note Winds. She's an exceptional student and deserves this honor. Congratulations, Jacqueline. This year's theater award goes to someone who is incredibly special and dear to my heart. Not just because I have had the blessing and honor of having him in my class for four straight continuous years. Um, not just because he has been in every single fall production and in every single spring musical for the past four years. And I have had the pleasure of watching him grow over those four years. And not because he has won more acting awards than any other student in Cuthbertson history. The reason he's receiving this award is because of his love for people, his welcoming nature, his ability to accept criticism with grace and even occasionally enthusiasm. And most importantly, his willingness to always try something new and always take risks. So Dan DeMilo, never stop taking risks, never stop loving people. It is my honor to give you this year's theater award. Thanks. Out of the students that we considered for the Visual Arts Award this year, this student stood out for her dedication to continuous development of her skills and the care that she showed her peers. As she progressed through the levels of art, one, two, three, four, and AP, and even peer tutored for a semester, you could see the incremental progression in her understanding of how to clearly communicate through visual expression. I'm particularly proud of how she pr pushed through moments of frustration in order to find the successful solutions that were possible. The 2020 recipient for the Visual Arts Senior of the Year Award is Macy Ormond. The Cuthbertson High School Career and Technical Education Department is very proud to announce that the recipient of the 2020 CTE Award is none other than Mario Gallardo. I don't think that there is another student in Cuthbertson history who has taken more CTE classes than Mario. In each and every one of those classes, your teachers, Mario, have been amazed by you. Mr. Lyons says you are always willing to participate in class and you are appreciative of what you are being taught. Ms. Crocker thinks you are one of the hardest working students that she's ever had and that you're just an all around amazing young man. Mr. Shumate says you are one of the kindest, most respectful young men he has had the pleasure to teach. And Ms. Comer thinks you have a great work ethic and she was so proud of you when you passed the Photoshop certification test. After having taught you in more than one class, I must say that I agree with all of them. You are a very special person, Mario. You are capable of so much and I hope that you don't let anyone or anything stand in the way of your dreams. The CTE department loves you and we are so proud to award you the Class of 2020 CTE Award. Congratulations, Mario. The 
the CHS English Department is proud to award the 2019-2020 English Award to Lily Anderson. Uh, Lily, you're a great student. JP said he loved you in mythology. Jen Mitchell said that you brighten the whole room every single day. And in my class, um, not only were you a great writer, but you were awesome at class discussions. You read everything very carefully. You brought amazing ideas to the table and you challenged your classmates to think through what they were saying. And so to my mind, you're the model of a perfect English student. And we are just so happy that you were able to get this award. Congratulations. Hello Cavs, I'm Coach Katie Helms and I am here to present the award for the Senior Health and PE student. This student has been amazing in many of our classes. Not only has he been a student, but he's also been a peer tutor. And at this point, he's probably taken enough classes that he could teach the classes himself. And our award is going to Matthew Moore. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It is my pleasure to announce the next senior award. The senior who's getting this award, just like everything else she has gotten in her life, she has earned. She has earned it with hard work, with dedication, and with a never give up attitude. This student never believes that anything is impossible or too hard. She just works harder. And I'm sure these admirable traits are gonna follow her to High Point University. So on behalf of the finest teachers around, this award goes to Aaliyah Bryant. Congratulations, Aaliyah. The mathematics department is proud to recognize a senior for their hard work in the field of mathematics. This student has an inquisitive mind and has excelled in the mathematics classroom by taking both AP Calculus and AP Statistics. The student approaches problems from different viewpoints and uses this ability to peer tutor for multiple math classes. Past and current math teachers describe the student as meticulous and hardworking. The teachers value the contribution the student brings to class lessons, often in the form of the student writing elaborate solutions on the whiteboards. This student's inherent motivation results in them solving every math problem and sometimes additional problems when they feel they need more practice or just for fun. This student's never satisfied with good enough and is determined to do their best in order to fully understand the material. The recipient of the 2020 Cuthbertson High School Mathematics Award goes to Taylor Corcoran. The Science Department has chosen Nick Nunez to receive the Science Award this year. Why Nick? He's a great student. We all know that. But it was more than that. It was the joy that he brought to learning. The excitement that he brought to the classroom. The times when you could hear him say, no matter what the topic or whatever it was, but when he learned something new and he would just exclaim, that's so cool. And that is really what science is all about. That joy of discovery. That is what Nick has. And I'm sure that carries over in all subjects, but in science, that is especially important. And we truly believe that Nick Nunez is going to make a great scientist someday. Congratulations, Nick. We all appreciate you. Greetings on behalf of the Cuthbertson Social Studies Department. And it's my privilege to announce that Miles Wilkin is the recipient of the 2019-2020 Cuthbertson Senior Social Studies Award. Miles wins this award for more than just academics. To be sure, Miles' academics are as strong as any due to a relentless intellect and an unflagging work ethic, but there are other characteristics that he brings to the table, which earned him this honor. We do not simply hand it out after a glance at student GPAs. One of the chief qualities that we look for, it's hard to put into words, 
We look for someone who sees beyond grades to meaning and implications of the material they've learned and who has an underlying skepticism towards things that parade themselves as knowledge just because others think it is. Who sees the social studies disciplines as a means to understand and thus exercise leadership. Throughout his time here, Miles has captured the essence of those sometimes ineffable qualities. If he's in the room, be prepared for probing questions. He's always out to answer, so what? And what can I do with this? In addition, whether he realizes it or not, Miles carries himself as a statesman. Time and again, he's demonstrated an ability to negotiate and work with others in a diplomatic manner while never compromising on principle. That's not a common quality by any measure. In Miles, it works because those qualities flow from a sense of humanity, a genuine concern for how issues, events, and even his own actions will affect others. He's determined to see that equality, fairness, and justice prevail. Like James Madison, Miles is that rare blend of academic and practitioner. Not many years from now, he could easily walk back into our department as part of the staff and fit right in with his mind, his personality, and dry, sometimes edgy wit. Put another way, he's one of us. So from all of us at the Social Studies Department, congratulations, Miles. This year, the World Languages Department recognizes a senior who was a top performer both in class and on the AP Spanish exam, and who was also Cuthbertson's first student to be invited to Governor School for Spanish. I think his most notable achievement was in accepting that invitation. Going to Governor School means giving up a lot of the summer, giving up plans with friends. But by letting go of what was familiar, he met new people, engaged in new ways of thinking, and created new memories. He reminds us that knowing another language provides that opportunity to all of us who speak and who listen with the intent to understand. And so it is with great pleasure that the World Language Department presents its senior award to Jack Murray. Felicidades, compañero. It is now time to present the Principal's Award. The Principal's Award is given to the student that is the most well-rounded student at Cuthbertson High School. At Cuthbertson High School, we pride ourselves on the three A's, arts, academics, and athletics. This young man has checked the box in all three of those areas. I'm extremely honored to recognize Mr. Christian Phelps. It is now time to present the Superintendent's Award. The Superintendent's Award is given to the student that demonstrates the best leadership at Cuthbertson High School. I have had the honor and the privilege of working side by side with this student as she represented the student body. I'm extremely proud to give you this Maya Hayes. Once again, congratulations to all the seniors that were recognized tonight. We are incredibly proud of you, as well as all 450 graduates. We miss you, we love you, and we can't wait to see you at graduation. Go Cavs!